Yeah. Everybody look at that. I bet you guys didn't know I lived with Taylor Lautner. Yeah, I do. Hi strangers. Saturday here or Raven. It doesn't really matter. It is September 25th, 2010 and I had a really eventful day today. Um, I took up the violin a couple weeks ago and I joined a beginning orchestra for that and it's been really fun. I had to get up really early this morning to go because it was way across town and otherwise I was going to be late. And I had a good time doing that and after that I went to an art show. Um, some of you may know, I live in Chicago so during the summer we do a lot of things and during the winter we have a lot of activities that we get to do and today there was an art show and it was really awesome down in Hyde Park and there were a lot of people who had like these amazing handmade goods that were really awesome and then um, my mom actually bought this book well it wasn't a book it was the outside covering of a book and then it was turned into a purse and it was really it was really awesome the nerd in me did sigh a little because I mean there's a book somewhere that's naked now because its cover has been turned into an accessory but overall it was a pretty good idea um, one thing I did get at the art show was this bear with no eyes but it's a really amazingly adorable butterfly bear and I really like it. It's really cute. Um, so this week, I think the theme is fears, but I'm not sure. But I still have a lot of time in my video, so I'm just going to go ahead and tell you my fears. Um, I have some basic fears. I'm afraid of heights, deathly afraid of heights, which really sucks because a lot of my friends are serious roller coaster hounds. So whenever we go out to like an amusement park, I always, you know, end up holding the bags or watching the whatever, watching something that isn't and doing something that isn't on the roller coaster because I would probably have a heart attack and die. When I was in the seventh grade, I wrote this story about this little boy and it was I can't really remember all the story. I just remember that it was about a boy whose mom was manically depressed and it was probably one of the best works that came out of my middle school career and I really liked it and I let this girl on the bus read it because she was just constantly hassling me about it and I let her read it and she liked it so when I kept writing it she kept reading it and she would give all this awesome feedback and it would be amazing and I would feel really good about myself and because you know someone else could read my story and enjoy it but then she took my story and moved away and I flipped out because if I ever see that story if I ever see a story with a main character who's a little boy named Micah and has a mom that is manically depressed and anything like that, I'm gonna lose it. So strangers, keep a lookout, because if you ever see a story that's like that, then let me know so that I can read it and compare and contrast, and we'll see what's going on with that. I'm afraid that my life will just go on and the only people who will remember me are me and the family that I have. Um, I want the world to know that I existed, that my whole existence meant something to all of humanity, even if it's just a little, a little difference that I made. Um, I really want someone somewhere to look back or hear about my life and say, wow, she really made a difference. In Will's video, he had he hung a lot of stuff on his wall, and I thought that, that was really awesome because I love hanging stuff on my wall personally. I just think that it's so fun, and you get to find things that are significant to you to put up, and it's really awesome. And I was going to join in on the hang stuff on your wall challenge, um, but... I don't have any space because this wall that I'm filming in front of is Taylor's wall and 
the wall that's over here by the clock that tells me what time it is actually in here is my Robert Pattinson wall and I've got a lot of stuff to of that nature over there and then as I go down to my room down the walls of my room I already have a lot of stuff that stuck up there drawings that I did pictures of my friends artwork graduation stuff um, other paintings and things that I have up there and wall posters and stuff like that but as I all right so for my hang up challenge I'm just gonna simply hang up a picture of Twilight's Taylor Lautner Ooh, what? I know what you're all thinking yeah cuz she really needs another picture of Taylor on her wall I know I do mm -hmm. there you go all right strangers I will see you tomorrow or Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday or Thursday or Friday